When we talk about aliens, we talk about the search for extraterrestrial life. Now we have multiple sightings by multiple modes. That is the gold standard. The quest for life beyond Earth is still in its early stages, but science has provided an encouraging early answer. There are plenty of planets in the galaxy, many of which are similar to our own. What we don't know, on the other hand, fills volumes. Observations from both the ground and space have revealed the existence of thousands of planets beyond our solar system. Our galaxy most certainly contains billions. So far, however, there is no proof of life beyond Earth. But a recent breakthrough has ignited excitement in the search for extraterrestrial life. NASA, the renowned space agency, has announced the detection of a massive celestial object that is transmitting radio signals to Earth. This revelation challenges our notion of solitude in the universe and triggers a mix of fear and excitement. What could be the implications of this radio communication? What might be the source behind these signals? Join us as we delve into NASA's warning of an enigmatic object in space that has initiated communication with Earth in our intriguing video. In the thousands of years that humanity has been studying the cosmos, we are the first to know one thing for certain. The stars beyond our sun are teeming with planets. They appear in a variety of sizes, with the majority of them being about the size of Earth. However, like with most scientific issues, finding an answer to this one only leads to new questions. Which, if any, of these exoplanets support life? What is the rate at which life begins? How long will it last? The eerie silence of the universe has its own name, the Fermi Paradox. Enrico Fermi, a physicist, famously asked, where is everybody? Even at sluggish travel rates, the universe's billions of years of existence provide sentient technological life forms plenty of time to cross the galaxy. Why then is the cosmos so quiet? Meanwhile, discoveries of exoplanets over the last two decades have filled in a few of the variables in the much debated Drake Equation, a series of statistics that could one day tell us how many intelligent civilizations we can expect to find. The majority of its terms remain unfilled, the fraction of planets having life, intelligent life, observable technology, but the equation itself suggests that we may one day find an answer. It's at least a little more optimistic than Fermi's silence. Consequently, NASA and other space agencies have devoted their efforts to developing sophisticated instruments capable of detecting any signs of life beyond Earth. These custom-made tools include specialized telescopes and advanced alert systems designed to identify radio signals and other anomalies originating from distant galaxies. Through these intricate systems, scientists have made astonishing discoveries, such as the detection of powerful radio signals originating from a galaxy located approximately 9 billion light-years away. The capability to trace the origin of these signals has unveiled remarkable insights about our universe that surpass our wildest imagination. This discovery marked a groundbreaking milestone, being the first recorded signal from such a vast distance. Additionally, it represented the initial confirmation of strong lensing of the 21 centimeter line or hydrogen line emission originating from a massive object. NASA astronomers regarded these findings as highly significant as they held the potential to enhance our understanding of dark energy and dark matter, two enigmatic components that dominate the universe. The radio signal, detected by the giant MetaWave radio telescope located in India, initially perplexed scientists. It did not emanate from expected sources like stars or black holes, fueling speculation within the scientific community about the possibility of extraterrestrial origins. However, further investigation revealed that the signal likely originated from a massive black hole at the center of the distant galaxy. The intense radiation emitted by the black hole's surroundings was powerful enough to be captured by the radio telescope. While the detection of the radio wave has not definitively proven the existence of extraterrestrial life, NASA acknowledged its contribution to the growing body of evidence suggesting that we may not be alone in the universe. Intriguingly, the signal appeared to originate from the direction of Proxima Centauri, adding an additional layer of intrigue. Scientists cautioned against dismissing the signal as it displayed a distinct techno-signature inconsistent with natural origins. 
Ongoing efforts aim to ascertain if this radio wave was indeed transmitted by an extraterrestrial civilization. The unique techno signature of the signal also left scientists astounded, suggesting that the extraterrestrial civilization behind it possessed an unprecedented level of advancement. NASA's long-standing efforts to search for signs of alien life finally seemed to bear fruit with the ongoing investigation into these mysterious radio messages. The nature and purpose of the signal have sparked various speculations within the scientific community. One faction theorizes that if the messages truly originate from an extraterrestrial civilization, they could be an expression of peace from more advanced beings in outer space, indicating a friendly intent. Conversely, another faction believes that the signal might serve as a warning. It is possible that the alien civilization has acquired information about an impending catastrophe heading towards Earth and is attempting to alert us. Alternatively, some speculate that the message could contain the blueprint for advanced technology that these extraterrestrial neighbors wish to share, potentially revolutionizing our world. However, the origin of the signal raises even more intrigue. The Proxima Centauri system, with its secrets yet to be fully unraveled, holds particular interest. Within this system lies Proxima b, a rocky planet residing in the habitable zone. Proxima b possesses the necessary conditions to support life. The proximity of this advanced radio signal emanating from a star system with a potentially habitable planet further fuels the belief that we may be on the brink of discovering extraterrestrial life. However, there is a cautious faction within the scientific community that expresses concerns that the radio messages might be a trap set by a hostile extraterrestrial civilization intent on invading Earth. Drawing from popular media depictions, this faction perceives a potential threat from aliens seeking to conquer our planet. They also speculate that the radio message could potentially carry a harmful technology or virus intended for use against us. Andrew Simeon, a scientist from the University of California, and his research team dedicated several months to studying the peculiar signal. Their investigation revealed that the waves exhibit distinct characteristics that set them apart from anything previously encountered. One notable feature was the signal's remarkably low signal-to-noise ratio, making it challenging to detect. Additionally, the signal occupied an exceptionally narrow radio spectrum band, indicating that it did not originate from human-made satellites or spacecraft. The inability to attribute the signal to existing technology added to its intrigue. Adding to the intrigue, the signal successfully passed various astronomical checks conducted by the team, further perplexing the researchers. Andrew Simeon remarked, we have not identified a natural mechanism capable of compressing electromagnetic energy into a single bit with the frequency observed in this radio signal. As Simeon and his team delved deeper into their analysis, they uncovered more intriguing details about the wave's properties. Notably, the signal exhibited a high level of polarization, meaning that the electric field of the radio message vibrated in a specific direction. This polarization characteristic is highly atypical for naturally occurring radio waves, strongly suggesting that the signal was artificially generated. Furthermore, the researchers noted that the signal exhibited a periodicity of 16.35 days, indicating a repeating pattern at that interval. This characteristic introduced an additional layer of complexity to the signal's nature. The periodicity led the team to speculate that the signal might originate from an object in orbit with a highly eccentric path. Upon further examination of the signal's data, the scientists discovered that its intensity varied over time, punctuated by sporadic bursts of higher intensity. The timing and pattern of these bursts did not follow a readily discernible or consistent sequence, contributing to the enigma surrounding the radio message. The irregularity of the high-intensity bursts prompted the researchers to consider potential interference from artificial sources like satellites or spacecraft. However, the signal's narrow spectrum band and other unique properties made it highly improbable for human technology to be the cause. Andrew Simeon also put forward the hypothesis that the signal could stem from an exotic phenomenon related to plasma physics. Currently, there is no known natural mechanism to compress electromagnetic energy into such a narrow radio spectrum band. However, Simeon emphasized that this was merely a theoretical conjecture, 
underscoring the need for further investigation to accurately determine the origin of this remarkably concentrated radio wave. The groundbreaking project responsible for detecting the enigmatic radio message was spearheaded by Andrew Simeon, with generous financial support from billionaire Yuri Milner. Launched in 2015, the project aimed to scour the vast cosmos using radio telescopes worldwide in search of evidence of technological civilizations. The announcement of this endeavor was accompanied by great fanfare, featuring prominent figures like the late Stephen Hawking and esteemed leaders in the field of space and science. Since its inception, Simeon and his team have tirelessly scanned the skies, ceaselessly seeking signs of extraterrestrial life. Thus, the discovery of this peculiar radio signal represents a significant breakthrough in the field of astrobiology and has generated tremendous excitement within the scientific community. Astronomer Jason Wright from Pennsylvania State University has been an ardent supporter of this discovery, amplifying the buzz surrounding the radio signal's significance. Wright highlights that the detection of this highly complex radio signal was not a mere coincidence. Scientists and astronomers have dedicated substantial time to gather data from Proxima Centauri, the red dwarf star closest to our Sun, for several years. It is important to note that while the Breakthrough team acknowledges the possibility of a natural explanation for the signal, they are committed to exhaustively investigating all potential natural phenomena before conclusively determining whether it signifies extraterrestrial life. They aim to avoid raising false hopes or precipitating disappointment by prematurely declaring the signal's origin and purpose. Nonetheless, this enigmatic radio message remains one of the most captivating signals ever detected by a space research program. What are your thoughts on this intriguing signal from space reaching Earth? Do you believe it provides evidence of advanced life forms attempting to establish contact? Share your perspectives in the comments section below.